CEO, Coach Randall, and Grant here. Um, Coach, very obviously a very tough team to play. Um, seemed like you had them right where they where you wanted in the first half. Um, what was it about the second half that uh, just couldn't uh, catch up with them? Well, you know, we they, they're, they're a very talented offensive team, and um, they got us in transition. Um, we had some miscommunication that just killed us in some stretches there, and they, you know, they, they went 10 for 15, I think, from the three-point line in that second half. Yeah, I mean, that's a gaudy number. That's not going to win you many games. And we just uh, let Anderson get loose. We let Dean uh, or Kakar get loose um, in that second half. And then we just gave up too many offensive rebounds, which, you know, that's 16 offensive rebounds. I don't know how many points they scored off of them. That's 17 points. It was a huge deal. Um, I thought these two guys played, you know, uh, two their, their two best games individually, offensively of the, of the year for sure. Um, it hurt having Francis in that foul trouble, um, and then eventually fouling out uh, a stretch. And we we didn't get some you know performances from some guys who have been really consistent and good for us, and that hurt, you know. And then you know just being down a few guys has been a big deal. You know, we don't have the margin for error. Um, we're not where we need to be defensively, and. Um, you know, we just we, our execution level is stuff you don't really see from a, probably a crowd perspective, but our execution on both sides of the ball is is, is subpar, and that's hurting us um, consistently. But you know, we battled and fought a very good team today, and um, you know, we just we didn't have enough. See you. Uh, how tough was it uh, defending the perimeter against uh, Barry's day and your your play uh, personally? Um, what would you have wanted to improve on? <clears throat> Just not fouling. I think that was, like Coach said, that's the, that's the big um, big takeaway from this game. Like Just not giving away easy points and not putting myself in a position where I can't help my team. But, um, yeah, just not fouling. I think that was the, I think that was the real uh, tall tale of the game because we fouled so much they were at the free throw line and, you know, a lot, they had a lot of shooters that were able to see the ball go through the net and get going off that. Grant, one of your better games this year, um, but in that second half, um, what was it that you probably uh, wanted to do better uh, defensively and um, personally? Uh, communication. I pride myself on talking to my teammates and being there for them. I, just, I could tell I wasn't... Um, too worried about getting beat and too worried about the other side of the ball when I should be worried about the defense, which has been my problem all year personally. Now it's becoming more of a team problem. We can't win games when other teams score 97 points. Um, yeah, so I, I just think on ball pressure is a big thing for me as well. Um, and it's going to it's gonna come with time, but have to get better at that to stay on the court and to win games, unfortunately. so. Coach, at the beginning of the year, you said this is probably the toughest conference uh, in the country. Um, you played a very good Barry team today. Now you have Tampa uh, on Wednesday. How? What's your evaluation of where uh, this group is right now? Um, well, we're we're uh, we're not where we need to be. I mean, that's definitely. I mean, it, it, obviously, it hurts um, not being at full strength. You know, that's and, and that's going to be for a while. I assume here. So, um, but we. Um, we have to get better. It starts on the defensive side. The two two areas that are in our biggest control. Because sometimes the officials, so, and I thought the officiating has been really good coming back the last two games. For, when I say that full disclosure, it's been very good. So I'm not making excuses at all. But we sometimes you're not you're going to get a, what, a tough whistle. Sometimes the ball's not going to go through the hole um, as well. Sometimes the ball just bounces funny. But we we two games in a row now we've had multiple deflections and loose balls and not gotten them. Like we've been on the floor. And then not got and then not gotten out of that scramble mode. That's one area you can control. Like win those win those 50-50 balls. That's one. Execution. I mean, and you're talking about literally when I say execution is a broad based term. Like how, where are we? You know, coming out of a timeout. What are we running? Communicating at a free throw line. Are we run it? Do we run? Our, do we run it? And we take our time and and, and hit physical screens. Um, be legal. Move the ball. Run. Be in the appropriate spot. Start to play when you're supposed to be. You know, and then and be in the, the correct. Um, and, and, and scout report part of that too. You know, making for numerous times today, their lefties went left, their only right guys went right, uh, their shooters were we closed with their hands down. Those are that's, those are execution. And then um, the, the last part, we just got to be better defensively, which you know, ties into some of the execution part for sure. But we're just we're, we're beat in one-on-one situations too often. 
and not where we need to be um, to pick up our teammates and help and rotation and, and uh, that's got to get along that's got to get better and Tampa's a physical tough team and it's a big rivalry game and, and they're, they're physical we have to be we have to be better on Wednesday for sure all right thanks guys all right thank you